We are learning more tonight about the massive amount of important data deleted from Dallas Police Department computers. Information security experts call it a bad mistake that the city blames on one employee. J.D. Miles looks at the potential impact on criminal cases. It had been a city hall secret for four months until Dallas County District Attorney John Crusoe exposed it in a letter after only finding out himself last week. 22 terabytes of data from the Dallas Police Department deleted by an employee during a server transfer in April. So I would say this is a, this is a eye opener, right? Um, especially uh, the size of the data that was lost and the type of data that was lost. Nick Powers runs a cybersecurity consulting firm called Uncommon. He says each terabyte is about equal to the memory of eight iPhones, and the lost data could amount to a mountain of evidence. A hundred hours of, of videos that were taken by detectives, or you know, even more than that, uh, you know, thousands of minutes of 911 calls. The city released a statement saying the lost files include images, video, audio, case notes, or other items collected by DPD personnel in the course of their routine daily duties, and that the city is actively working to recover the data and will continue to coordinate with the DA's office to identify which cases may have been affected. I think it's problematic when a person has sole access to some of these uh, files that contain uh, evidence of, you know, of cases that are uh, that are being worked on by DPD. Or Dallas Police Association President Mike Mata questions how a city employee even had access to the potential evidence. But Mata says the public should not be worried that what happened will cause criminals to go free. Uh, one thing I do want to, you know, assure the public that every investigator uh, usually has their own hard copy of case files. Dallas will now conduct a citywide audit searching for the data that was deleted on devices such as cameras and laptops. Only those cases before June of 2020 will be impacted. The city also says it's made changes to make sure just one person can't delete data and that it's stored longer. But no one can say at this point for certain whether criminal cases will be impacted. Reporting in Dallas tonight, J.D. Miles, CBS 11 News.